I'll use the fire deck. Warsaken. All right, here we go. Taking on tech. Warsaken Blitz. My third game of the broadcast. Make sure my notes are up to speed. I already thought they were. I thought, oh, let's double check. And sure enough, oh, I hadn't typed in the next game yet. So I lost to CVN Live, lost to Jungle Banano. They both secured a spot in the prize round at the end of the broadcast. The only pair I have are building cards, and that's not something I'm going to use right away. And that's what I'm looking for, some, at least a pair of something I can use initially. So I'm going to use a mulligan. It'll reshuffle my arsenal of 60 cards and deal me another eight cards. Well, it could be some of the same. We'll see. Pair of weather cards. Keep. Don't want to be too picky when it comes to your starting eight Warsaken Blitz. This is the Slate Lux game map that I'm using with this deck today. Got the orange card backs with the black Warsaken logo. You can customize those by deck. Customize things like your battle title. All sorts of things you can do. Keep in mind, this is the beta release still. We're still in the beta. It doesn't feel like it, though, because this game plays so smoothly and it's so much fun. Really strong UI. And a great community of people to play. Roll five. So I've got a weather match here with air pollution. Go for the extra turn. I still have two actions to go for this turn. Play pair of forest cards. A7 axe. The water on fire. Extra turn. Two. All right. Play a pair of force cards. Z27 Tiger. Two sets of two force, and that ends the turn. Take it on tech. So we've got Warbot giving out loot to people with linked wax wallets here in chat. A live player versus player competition. Special thanks to Carl Casey at White Bat Audio, who makes much of the great background music that I use here on Nashville New Live. It's roll three for tech. A pair of weather cards. And a forest card with Igor Bach, the electrical engineer. One. Okay, nothing makes a match. I really don't want to put a third force card out there. Uh, so I won't. So I'll pass up that action in the turn. It would be different if I had a force match. I'm talking like a third. Like I'm putting a drop ship out there. I might be asking for trouble. It's a roll of four for tech. There's a four smash, Igor Bach, electrical engineer. So I'm down to three territories. Two actions to go for the turn, and Agent Nika Devin's sneaking her way around. Pair of weather cards, pair of force cards, my turn. Five. I've got a pair of force matches set up. A7 axe, force. That force match eliminates one of my opponent's four territories. Minus four morale. The 18 for morale drops down to 14. If you're curious about the numbers on the shield, are there new people that are watching all the time? And hello to everybody watching over on DraftKing.com, my NFL Draft website where I've also set up an entire Warsaken card catalog. I also have my Warsaken video vault there over on DraftKing.com. Had that site since 2003. Four actions to go for the turn. DX8, force. This drops me, or my opponent down to two territories remaining, so tech with two left. I have one action to go for the turn. Three spots open in my war zone. I'm going to leave it at that. Pass up the action in the turn. So tech's down to two territories. I have three remaining.
Well, there's a lot of positives to it for sure, Jungle Banana. Because I don't have to use the delay with this. You can be social. You can chat with it. It's a great community of people. It's not difficult to learn how to play. And it's entertaining. Even a certain evergreen element to these... The games themselves. Roll six. So Tech with a second force match. Both be down to two territories. Agent Nika Devon eliminates Clementine Meyer. Weather. A pair of weather cards. Two sets of two weather, to be precise. Tech with three actions to go for the turn. A pair of force cards. That ends the turn. My turn. Three. Nothing makes a match. But I can play a pair of Burn Notice Intel cards on fire. A pair of Intel's pair of Force cards. Two spots open in my war zone with one action to go for the turn. I think the better move is to keep that open. Although, with Tech lined up here, I don't know how many more rolls I'll have. We'll see. Pass up that action in the turn. It's roll of one. Remember the grand prize for today. Go to somebody that beats me live on stream, that rank two epic building card. My turn. Four. Always the question, how long do you wait for a WMD match to show up? No guarantee it'll happen. I only have one other Force card total in hand, so that would be kind of tricky if I did that at this point. Although, uh, time's going to run out on me soon. Tech is tough. Uh, I play a pair of Weather cards. I think I'm going to do that. Keep the Force spot in my War Zone open. I just played a, a Force card now. I think that would severely damage my chances to win, even though I think Tech is in a pretty strong spot here. I think this is still the move. Even though it might not be the most promising overall. Comparatively, I think it's the, the best risk-reward. Pass of the actions in the turn. So my next War Saken Blitz broadcast will be Monday. 2 p.m. Eastern Daylight Time, 1800 UTC, my usual start time. That's Monday with episode 97 of War Saken Blitz. Five actions, 15 cards. There's a force match. You know, I was talking about how long do you wait on playing that third force? Well, the time is now for tech. That's me down to one territory. Another force match means I've got to compromise later. One more force match would beat me. Weather card. My turn. Three. Well, I can play Intel. Bounce some weather cards. Let's bounce. A violent tornado. Lasting blizzard. Freezing Rainstorm. Bounce. But that's it for the turn. And all Tech needs is a Force Match to beat me. So I'll have a Foil Prime card given away. A Warsaken prize link will be posted in chat near the end of my hourly break first person to get on that link and click the claim gets it we'll have another in the next hour as well three actions to go for the turn off a roll of three 13 cards so a second weather I'm saying a force match could beat me right there. there's a pair i'm gonna get another roll never give up hope in war sake and blitz as long as you still have cards in your arsenal one 
At least there's that. I'm not going to be able to keep dodging that last four smash from Tech forever, but... Freezing Rainstorm, play that. It's a roll of five. Surely this will do it. Tech just needs one force match to get the win. I've got to compromise later. Weather, so an extra turn. A pair of force cards. I guess Tech doesn't have a force match in hand. So we'll see what happens with the extra turn. It's a roll of five. With all that out there in 16 cards, just need one force match to beat me. Will this do it? A pullback to make room. This will probably be it right here. No, it's weather. The dramatics. So that's another extra turn to keep in mind, but. I mean, eventually I'm gonna run out of time here. There's Igor Bach to finish the job. Roll a three, this ought to do it right here. You can't play a weather match now. It's either you get a force match to bait me or I get another roll. Because even if you did a pullback, you wouldn't have enough actions left to play a weather if you had it. There's two with the A7X. If there's a third, that's the game. There's a pullback. And an Intel card. My goodness. I'm still alive. My turn. Six. All right. Well, I've got some weather options over here, don't I? Got burn notice. We've got a few things to do. Okay, so let's line up a couple extra turns. Cloud cover. Ahem. Said cloud cover. Thank you very much. Extra turn. There's one extra turn pending. Freezing rainstorm. Weather. Icy. So I've got two extra turns pending. Waiting on the drop ships, hoping I can get a WMD match to show up. Burn notice, Intel. Let's bounce. Three sets of two fours, split these up quite nicely. Force. Force, force, and force. Bounce. Okay, I can play two of these. Get the drop ships out there. Now the extra turn. One. Like a building card, maybe? My really, only chance is to catch like WMD and Force. Building card, might be able to buy myself some time if something goes odd here, but I don't know. Now that second extra turn. Oh, extra dramatic. It did not let me click. So the F5 takes all oh, two seconds for it to reload. This is the second extra turn. It's the quick game reset if you missed it. So here we go, second extra turn, two. Man. Well, I mean, you never know what might happen here. Final Devotion. Here are WMDs. In turn. What a wild game this has been. It's not over yet. Tech just needs one force match to bait me. There's one constant for the last several minutes. Five. So those are enough actions where if Tech needed to open up a space, there'd be room to play a force match to get the win. Intel could mess up some problem, some things for me in my uh, war zone. Weather would mean an extra turn. 20 cards in hand for tech. But remember, a WMD match won't help at this point. You have to have a force match to eliminate a compromised leader and win the game. Tech said the bounce was really good. How lucky timing. The dramatics here. Intel. No. I knew the risk I was taking there. The WMD and the building card. Pair of building cards. Building card match. What you going back for, Tech? You got a bunch of options. <laughs> then you get a force match and be done with it. Bring back Agent Nika Devin to sneak across, my nemesis. Gonna mix and match of stuff. Well, 
My turn. Six. Building card match. Okay. Let's think about this. I can go building card match, extra turn. I don't know. I think that's got to be the move, though, right? So we'll go underwater mines. I can bring back two fire in the field. Well, the problem was I had. Well, let's look in here. Well, this. Oh, you know what? Because I had two of those WMDs out there. Oh, that really bit me. That really bit me right there. Man, okay. But there's a fourth that might drop in. But if I go back for weather. Well, I can go back for fire in the fields, two of them, and then a third. But the problem is I don't have gas, and I have to get at least. Oh. <laughs> man. It's tough when Intel gets involved in your live streaming. That's one thing with this. Like, man. But you never know in this game. All right. Well, you know, I'm going back for weather. I'm doing it this way. Underwater mines. I will get one of the final devotions. I'll make sure to be careful. I'll get two air pollutions. But only two. And then one final devotion. I'll have it in hand if the third shows up. So I'll play air pollution to get the extra turn. I'll roll a four or higher and get a WMD match in hand. I'd have the win. Let's see. Four! And it's going to happen, it looks like. My goodness. What a battle. Moz Gas. WMD match. Finally showed up. I don't think I've ever had a game of Warsaken Blitz play out quite like this one. Man. Compromised. Well, the X-27 Tiger for the win. What a game. Good game, Tech. Wild. Good game. My goodness. My battle tech. 